Hello guys, it is the next day, day A. So our German ally is gone. It looks like we've not been accepted into the Hellenic Republic, but the Kingdom of the Netherlands is definitely putting in work though against them. And all that. We've finally taken over the UK. Pretty good. Oh, yeah, and I guess you guys should notice these videos come like two days after I record them. On average, like a day and a half later. So if you do give me advice, it'll probably be a video too late. It happens and all that. You know? But um, let's keep upgrading our Dreadnoughts, shall we? That's the backbone of our army right now. Is the Dreadnoughts, Motorized, and Scout Bags. Alright, none of them will be able to get upgrades today. But in a few hours, too, exactly. The Scout Mech will be able to be upgraded, right? And will be one of those upgrades that... Ooh, it is a good upgrade. How good? Plus 45. Wow. Is that it? Uh, barely more damage. Just 0 0.1 against light targets, and that's it, it seems. Also, apparently more against ships and buildings by 0 0.1. Also, like how it's a defense stat against buildings. Definitely interesting. But, now that we've basically are in control of this area, I can move this gun back down here, I believe. Alright. No, yeah. I'll be building on my army for a day or two before I decide to go for the Netherlands and all that. You know? I do plan on hitting up each of the cities here on the coast. That would be a big moment for us when we do do that kind of attack. So for now, I can literally just move up these troops here. And also start fortifying all these places with... Uh, Industries, you know? Because he also he can do it by specific resources, I see. Interesting. Okay. So, um, can I, um, construct some industries for here? To level one? Not only Plymouth. Oh, not Plymouth doesn't need it. It's Glasgow and London that needs it. Right. Times two. Yeah. Nice. Bam. Now, let's look at Plymouth and all that, too, while we're at it. These need to be um, places that can make ships, in my opinion. So, I'm going to start work on some uh, naval yards here and all that. So Plymouth and London, I think I'd want to actually build the places. Birmingham would be a great place to make motorized and all that. So I'll get this uh, started with them. Of course, up north we're building uh, scout mechs and all that. You're building a dreadnought. You're building nothing. Okay, that's the last motorized I can build. Let's have this scout mech come down here to the left side towards Plymouth and they move very fast too I think they move faster and motorized do even nope motorized moves slightly faster so yeah that's how I'm coming to London then at least that group come to London these people need to be here right within the coast if need be and all that but I mean, yeah. Right now, we're just, I guess you could say building for Navy and all that, you know? We have everything to build, like, a few of them, so... It'd probably be better if I literally just... Did this. And see what can and what can't make subs and all that. Is the current progress start seven? Okay. For one, they would also need to have sword by naval yard. Yes, that's what y'all needed to sort by anyway. So this doesn't have any. So anything about Plymouth? 
would have a naval yard, from what I can see. Yeah, okay, now that's good. Now we can focus on producing some subs, I believe. Okay, we have to knock off probably two of them first off. Screw the ones already queued up. The ones that are actually making units and all that. So I think that affects it, right? It does. We almost have enough oil so I'll be able to make two of them. Okay. Let's start making uh, two subs then, shall we? And all that. Damn. And um, yeah, as I said, we're going to take a day or two off. And now the tacky one, just kind of build up arm a little bit and then push into the Netherlands. So hopefully, I understand, I'm just doing this so I can recruit my, recuperate my army and kind of regroup them too, down south. And all that. Since it is needed. Newcastle, uh, you should have enough to build a scout mech, right? Yeah. Let's get you started, you little bugger. Once that's done, I can probably have him move up to Norwich to kind of see what's going on there in the Netherlands. Right now I've got one, two, three. I've got three Dreadnoughts, which means I'll be able to hit up Antwerp, the Hog, and Amsterdam. Hopefully I'll be able to hit Groningen too. And due to this range, I might also be able to hit Brussels, right? Yeah, I'll be able to hit all their homeland cities and take them. If I can do that and take all this land, I'll then have all this under my control, and I'll bring me way closer to victory. Uh, especially since right now they're kind of draining troops against um, Germany, you know. But I mean, yeah, that's the plan. We're just chilling out right now and all that. I've almost fully recovered from my sickness too. I'm keeping troops on my homeland to defend it. Because that's not a mistake I want to make where I'm not defending it and all that. Um, yeah. If you want to set up any games with me, come check out the uh, Discord server and all that. Just saying, if you do, we can set up games together, have fun, all that. Let's set up some subs there. I typically do one, I record one game at a time now and all that. And usually it's with y'all if you're interested in the ones I'm playing. Sometimes I do Call of War, Conflict, Iron Order. Right now, the Call of War stuff, I'm taking a little break from it. Because I'm burnt out because the way the community is. Might come back to it one day, I do not know. Anyway, I think we're going to have this in the bag, at least in the Netherlands though, depending on how I play it. Um, I might want to go for some armor soon. Maybe some like light tanks. I can worry about that later though. Maybe like tomorrow I can start doing that since I'll be kind of chilled out. And then I'll probably turn Manchester into that kind of area then. Actually like a tank plant. Or a heavy factory as they call it. And then this will be where I make my tanks. Since everywhere else is like a infantry of ships. Scout mech. Scout mech. I mean no this is motorized at the moment. But um, yeah. We're preparing to move on to the Netherlands tomorrow. Let's see what the stats say for him, though. He is losing quite a bit of units. But he hasn't lost all provinces either. But the deaths, though, are pretty good for us so far. Let's look at the newspaper real quick, though. See what this guy could have. Thinking the Netherlands has captured Wizard. This is something that came to the Netherlands has captured Nuremberg. Okay. Netherlands is definitely losing some units though, that's for sure. Look at this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven losses just from Germany. Let's see. The Hellenic Republic's making militia? Or are they just defending with militia? You know, I'm sorry, so I was not brought into the coalition though. Duplication still there. He also gave himself a name. Interesting. 
What's his stats say? Okay, so he's level two now at the very least at the moment. I'm probably the highest level in here, honestly. Most likely I am. And I'll let anyway guys. I think this will be a good place to end this off. Hope I can catch y'all the next one tomorrow. Have a good one. Bye.